Your team coverage of winter storm Abel continues now from outside the state armory in Hartford, where staff will be monitoring conditions today. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland is live there now. Matt, what can you tell us? Well, Nicole and Eric, uh, the governor is not fully activating uh, the EOC, but uh, staff will be here monitoring the conditions, uh, responding accordingly throughout the day. Uh, you can see there are some uh, plow crews out here uh, sort of uh, just cleaning up what's left, uh, salting uh, the parking lots as well. Um, in fact, when Abel started yesterday, the Department of Transportation had more than 600 plow trucks ready to go along with another 200 independent contractors on standby. Now, the state is also reminding folks about its CT Prepares website and mobile app listing tips on how people should prepare for winter weather, what they should do, along with a list of important phone numbers uh, like utility companies here in Connecticut. And while the crews continue to clean up here in the capital city, the good news is for the kids here in Hartford, they do have a two-hour delay, so they get to sleep in a little bit later this morning. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in Hartford. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.